Guess what? What? I put jeans on. Whoa, you feeling fancy? I'm feeling better. Good morning, guys. It is a beautiful day. It's like 68 degrees and sunny. I'm sitting out here on the deck with Ollie Boy. And uh, Mary just edited half of the vlog. I finished the other half, and we're like teamwork in it today. But Mary's feeling, uh, as if you watched yesterday's vlog, she had some pleurisy pain. It's still kind of there but not she describes it as it's not a knife anymore it's a nice pick so headed in the right direction of that uh she felt like she slept better last night but i wanted to say i i think i'm going to let well i don't really have an option for getting a haircut at a barber shop and um home haircuts aren't really my thing so i think i'm just gonna let my hair grow until the world opens up again and so we'll see how long this hair gets but um yeah it's kind of a i think we're all gonna have crazy hairdos mary really likes this meme going around that we're all gonna look like this at the end of quarantine anyways memes Ma mary's in there laughing she laughs every time she looks at that thing uh She's just thinking about it. Uh, memes have definitely been a good uh, humor coping mechanism in the midst of all this quarantine stuff. Yes, what? Oh, what was Harry yelling about? We were outside and Harry was like, he was sitting in the windowsill and like standing at the door going meow, 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 because. I came and I said, oh, you need some snacks? And I, when I walk over toward the couch, he run, 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 runs and jumps up. And you needed some snugs? Sure, I'll give you some These snugs. two have a thing where she just opens the bottom of her sweatshirt and he just <laughs> crawls in and gets all snuggled up. It's so cute. Sometimes you just need some snugs. Oh, I don't know if I showed you guys this. Uh, well, first of all, I'll show you the progress I'm making on bringing the dirt from out front and covering the drainage system and it's kind of leveling out the yard there was kind of this deep valley from the water running through our yard and now it's going to be uh more level and uh so i've got a ways to go but i made some progress yesterday but here's another project we have our air conditioners here and uh i got these landscape timber weather whatever they are um and i'm going to make a little bed around these and mulch that and i think eventually we'll grow some shrubbery to hide the air conditioners shrubbery guess what oh did you want to come out hey babe hater hey, hi guess what what? I put jeans on. Whoa, you feeling fancy? I'm feeling better. I still have a little like, I guess I would describe it as like a like pinch, kind of, like when I get to right there in my breath. I was breathing in, if you couldn't tell, which you probably couldn't. Um, yeah, so I still have like pain in my lung, but it is so much better than yesterday. So I already chopped up a cucumber and put it in the pickle juice that I made like a week or two ago. Homemade pickles. I guess I should think about making some dinner. We have a little bit of chicken breast left that was cooked that I roasted a few days ago. So maybe I'll do something with chicken breast for dinner. Oh, so much. I'm so glad that I'm not in as much pain as yesterday. Holy. Kind of rough. All right, I'm gonna go outside and enjoy some sunshine. <sighs> wow, it's amazing. How's it going? How's it going? Good. Good job. Hi, Bunzi. Hi. How are you? Hey, I'm down here. I just sniffed my snot in like, like that and realized I couldn't do that yesterday. That hurt really bad. 
that's progress. I can sniff my snot in. Must try this. What is it? Lemon water. Taste the rainbow. It's a good. Refreshing. Dinner. Dinner. Dinner time. Hi, Luca. Hi. Ooh. Oh my goodness! Do we have barbecue chicken pizza? Try this. I want you to try this. Okay. Tell me what you think. I hope that's a good one. Mmm, that's so good. What'd you put on it? What do you taste? Is it sugar? Yep. Yum. Just like a tiny well, sprinkle of brown sugar. People do that, like sweet potato casserole. Doesn't have, or like, yeah, doesn't sweet. That have, yeah. Have like marshmallow or whatever. Mm hmm. These do not have marshmallow. I know, but I'm just saying sugar. Um, the, the flatbread. It's not pizza necessarily, but I guess it kind of is. But it's well, it looks um, amazing. got some stuff on it. So I'm gonna put these on our plates. I hope that pan doesn't burn the camera. This is amazing. Good. Um, okay. That was a lot. That. Yeah, and then, um, you want to grab a, like, spoon and get those vegetables out of that packet? I'm confused why some of these burn and some of them don't. So I took the rest of the chicken breast, the one from yeah. the rest of chicken, That's and I just put barbecue sauce and some seasoning on it and baked it that way. We should have a taste test of the flatbread because mm. I'm curious. I want to see if you can taste one specific thing. Mm. Okay, onion, garlic, tomato. I taste onion too, but I didn't put any. Mm. It's garlic. Oh, it's garlic. Okay, mm -hmm. that's. I a... put some honey on it. Oh, okay. I thought the. Sweet was the onion, mm. but it's honey. That makes sense. Yum. It's okay. I like it. Okay, good. All right, you guys ready for an evening update on the progress of Project Fry Life Backyard? First of all, look how sad this palm tree is. We brought it outside to see if it could revive, and uh, apparently that was a bad idea. But um, that's beside the point. Uh, okay. Look at this. This isn't, for most of you, this is going to look like nothing much but dirt in our backyard. But there was a valley where the dirt is now. And uh, now the it's pretty much an even grade down to here. I'm, I'm going to add some dirt in along here as well. Uh, so that it's still, the path of water is still the same. But with the French drain under the ground, it will suck in the water. Well, this <laughs> drain that's sticking up real high, I have it like that for now, uh, so that dirt doesn't get in it while I'm grading the yard. And then once we have the grass planted and everything's in place, then I will cut that drain down and make it right at the grade level of the ground. So. It'll be a ground level drain there if there's excess water, say we get like torrential downpour. Uh, it'll have a external drain there and watch out palm tree. We ha we'll have another one right here because um, the, the source of the majority of water is coming from this direction. So I wanted to have a drain in the middle of the yard and our side yard. Um, it kind of uh, is graded so that it kind of comes in right down to where the, I put this drain. So it was kind of intentionally placed. So it's going to take quite a bit more dirt to finish basically this grade 
all the way but that's the plan and the goal and we're quarantined so this is the project I'm working on and Mary and I started Mary was really excited so she wanted to start this tonight she's excited to put in a flower bed here uh, we have these humongous well this unit is pretty large and so we'd like to put in some shrubbery here to kind of hide this and uh, I'm sure Mary will want to put some flowers in here and stuff so we are using this uh, timber and we use rebar and Mary had the brilliant idea I was gonna drill a hole through all the pieces but she had the idea of for the top piece to drill almost all the way through so that it sits right on top but it, you can't see the rebar so we're tomorrow or probably not tomorrow we need to get a couple more pieces of rebar and uh, we're gonna bring it from there all the way over to here finish weeding this out we'll put some of the topsoil in here and then I bought some extra mulch that we'll put in here to keep the weeds away uh, while we figure out what we're gonna plant over here so that's your project fry life backyard update for tonight so guys we have a cat dog it's cat with the dog it looks like they're the same animal I don't know but Harry loves getting under the covers and snuggling and last night apparently he was sleeping under the covers by at Mary's feet and Ollie laid like Harry was on his side just dead asleep and Ollie laid on Harry and Harry just kept sleeping <laughs> <laughs> they are so funny together and some of you have wondered about what it is like to care for a naked cat they have to be bathed because uh, they don't have hair and so normally hair would carry the oils off the skin so naked cats naturally get oily and so we give him a bath about once a week. And here is a video of Mary doing that. Oh, do you want another bath, Harry? How are you doing in there? I didn't know you were in here. Okay. All right. Now it's all four of us in the bed. Hi. And uh, <laughs> do you have anything to say to the people? Thanks guys. Thanks for hanging in there with us through quarantine and all the weirdness that's going on right now. Um, I got a message from one of you guys and you said, you help me feel less alone. Mm. And that is, Really an honor like we've we've said before the when you guys welcome us into your home via these videos we feel honored and when we find out if one of our like high school friends or college friends says like oh we watch your videos we just are like oh my gosh just honored so thank you guys for spending time with us and we will as always see you tomorrow see you tomorrow guys good, good night, night. Night, hair man. I don't think you got him. Okay. Drag me in. Good night, hair man. And good night to the olive oil.